Okay, so now that we have the oil pump on, the next step is to start installing the front cover. And uh, what we have here, same gasket system as the rear cover. Uh, very nice piece that requires no silicone here. And uh, we are just going to line it up for now with a couple bolts. I like to do this with the engine upside down. It makes things a little easier. And uh, we'll get this in. All the external hardware we're using on this build is actually uh, ARP hardware. Okay, very nice. And now that doesn't use any kind of dowels like a small block Chevy. It's, it kind of free floats, right? And I know it, you're going to address that in a minute. It does, yeah. Just like the rear cover, it is uh, very much free floating and you have to use um, specific fixturing to make sure it is all centered. Not just for the scent seal on the front, but for the oil pan to be right. flashed there. You can see that's a little, the rail on the uh, block is a little proud, so if you imagine the oil exactly. pan going up on there, there's going to be a little bit of space and that's not good for leaks. Yeah, yeah, as it just sags here now, it has plenty of movement. Right. And we need to, you know, account for that with our fixture, which uh, we'll just do in just a second. Okay, now that we got all of them just started there, still floating around, we'll take our little alignment tool here and that just centers it now. So now we've lost that movement here and all we're concerned about now is the uh, forward, up or down motion. So it pretty locked it into place there. You want to be able to not have that shift on you. Don't have to go super tight. We're just trying to snug it up. And now we can start snugging these up. Making sure this isn't locked up on me yet. If it does, that means this got shifted somehow. So I just want to make sure that doesn't happen. Feels good. So now we'll do the uh, final torque. And that'll be 18 foot pounds. That comes out nicely. That way we know that cover is aligned right where it should be. So we're, this front cover is now flush with that oil pan and that gasket is just sitting a tiny bit proud. That's exactly what we want. So that'll seal nice. And now just to confirm that we torqued all the bolts, I like to do a little dot, especially on these ARP hardware. It just looks nice just to have a little dot right in the center on all of them. And that confirms that we did torque all of these bolts to specification.